वेलकम टू माई व्यूज एंड न्यूज व्यूर्स वी हैव रिसीव फर्स्ट अपडेट ऑन एफर्ट्स टू डिसमेंटल रीजनल स्पेशल फोर्सेस वी नो दैट इथियोपियन गवर्नमेंट हैज डिसाइडेड फेडरल गवर्नमेंट हैज डिसाइडेड टू डिसमेंटल ऑल स्पेशल फोर्सेस द स्पेशल फोर्सेज विल टर्न इन टू पुलिस और प्रिजन पुलिस सम माइट ज्वाइन इथियोपियन नेशनल डिफेंस फोर्स uh directives have been passed uh, to regions from the federal government and uh, uh, meetings were held in all regions to finalize modalities about uh, the dismantling of special forces we have been seeing that resistance uh was being seen in the amhara region uh so that is i were trying to get information from the amhara region about the meeting held there what happened there who participated who opposed who supported the dismantling of uh, special forces and what was the final decision made at the meeting we have details for you and secondly was uh, a protestant pastor has been baptized in wolaita the man is closer to orthodox uh, in his uh, religious and political beliefs it seems uh firstly viewers uh, special forces of the regions are going to be disbanded uh amhara uh, prosperity party executive committee central committee held meetings uh, a few weeks ago and their this proposal was finalized though at the meetings uh, some prosperity party members especially from the amhara region opposed uh, this decision but uh, a general uh, majority supported Uh, because top leadership is supporting dismantling uh, ethiopian intelligence agency is uh, supporting the dismantling of uh, special forces of regions federal security officials too ethiopian national defense force as well endf does not want any other special force to be uh, as strong or to be strong uh, when it comes to comparison between endf and regional forces ENDF a federal government don't want any regional special force to be a threat to national security in future like uh, Tigray uh, uh, forces uh, turned into Tigray defense force by capturing weaponry from northern command in November 2020 and then it led to start of two year long war so federal government believes that all special forces must be dismantled directive was passed to all regions uh, to hold meetings meetings with participation of ethiopian national defense force uh, special force members security officials and meetings were held uh, we were waiting for an update uh, on on the meeting from amhara region because we we have seen that uh, in amhara region there is no agreement uh, about this uh, banning of a special force meeting was held in bahirdar it was attended by endf officials uh, amhara special force commanders representatives of militias like fano and amhara regions uh, government officials from endf uh, abebout dase participated he is a general he is a top one of the senior Uh, uh military officers uh, in ethiopian national defense force i think he is an amhara he is from the amhara region secondly from amhara special force makale belate who is a major general participated uh from militias there were their representatives and from amhara region uh desalentasio participated uh desalentasio is uh, amhara regions uh, security uh, wing head and uh, at the meeting about dase clearly told 
the regional uh, government amhara special force fano militias that uh, government has decided that all special forces must be dismantled Abhay Bhattacharya was backed by Makale Balade, Amhara Special Force Commander, who supported Abhay Bhattacharya. Opposition came from militia representatives and from Amhara Regional Government Security Wing head Dasilintasio, who also opposed the decision of the federal government. so a consensus could not be created at the meeting almost half uh, opposed the move and those who opposed the move they obviously uh, justified their opposition by uh, talking about romo liberation army about uh, alleged preparations by tigray fighters etc etc they presented several arguments to oppose uh, to sum it up the meeting could not finalize modalities and the meeting ended without any agreement reached so federal government's decision to dismantle special forces is meeting with stiff resistance in the amhara region Desalentasio is Amhara government's security head. If Desalentasio is opposing uh, uh, dismantling of special force, it means Amhara regional government is opposing dismantling of Amhara special force. So one of the main concerns for Amhara regional government is uh, um, that uh, romia regional special force might not be dismantled and that uh, tigray will keep on having its militias and forces as well that tigray has not surrendered all tigray fighters have not surrendered all small arms that if special forces are completely dismantled raya and volkayat will easily be handed over to tigray so there were there are several apprehensions uh trust is not there between amhara regional government and ethiopian federal government and federal departments regarding this decision made by the federal government that is why so far meeting has been postponed let's what happens uh, will uh, the federal government press ahead with this decision or will it postpone the decision to dismantle a special forces will try to keep you updated about the key decision made by the federal government secondly we was uh, a protestant pastor has been baptized he was baptized in vulaita uh, at a church name of the church uh, is dabre uh, menkara Abune Teklehman Church. His name is Pastor Biniam Shitai. His new name is now Fikre Jizu. Protestants are baptized too. I think they believe in baptism, but their belief is not as strong uh, as that of uh, Catholics or Orthodox. I think. uh pastor biniam shitai is very close to ethiopian orthodox church though he is protestant but last year a protest was held at uh, maskel square not a protest a gathering was organized at maskel square by protestants orthodox church followers opposed that gathering there was confrontation between protestants and orthodox at maskel square because orthodox church believes that maskel square is property of orthodox church uh police intervened police dispersed the two uh, sects of followers police i think arrested several some were injured too in that uh, a confrontation pastor biniam shatai supported the orthodox church claim to the ownership of uh, maskel square then we saw that uh, when 
uh, a few weeks ago orthodox church uh, of ethiopia split and a new faction in oromia emerged uh, which was planning to form a new synod Uh, Beniam Shittai claimed that Abune Saviros and others, uh, archbishops of the Supplanter Orthodox faction, uh, were considering apologizing to the church. And later he was arrested. I think he has been arrested twice uh, in the past uh, two years or so. He is closer to Orthodox in his religious and political beliefs. political beliefs at least uh, he has been baptized at the church in uh, wolaika take watch